Hey guys, what's up? Today I'm going to be showing you how to make your own custom gun flashes and gun effects in a photo. Uh, you can use these in your videos, but it's mainly for like pictures and things. So let's go ahead and get started by creating a new. I'm going to make this 300 by 300 so it's easier to see. And we're going to go to open and open a picture that you have of like a gun. You holding a gun or something. I don't know. I'm just using a Gears of War 3 guy. For my example. Now you just want to go over here. And you want to zoom in on the picture so you can get a good shot at him. And you can use this one for bigger areas. If you make an escape or... If you make a mistake, press Control Z to go back. Kind of try to stay in the picture, just like that. Got all that. Now, once you have parts where you can't really use that thing, you just want to hold Shift and click where that you need to with this. Just gotta do this arm here. Just like that. Get everything that you possibly can in your picture. Now, once you have that and you're ready. Click Control X, or cut out your picture. Come to this one, press Control V. Now that you have your picture in here, you can drag it around to where you want it to be. That's perfect size, too. Now, we're going to get a little bit closer here. And we're going to get the red area. Now, if you've seen my video on how to make custom flames, this is the same type of deal, but it's a little bit easier. So now we just want to go to the paintbrush. We're going to drop the pixels to around, I'd say, not even that big. Whenever it looks kind of like this, put it kind of close like that. Then we're going to go to a nice orangish color, dark orangish. Drop that down. Set the dead center. You want four layers like this. And keep getting brighter and brighter. And smaller and smaller. Just like that. Now for this one you want a yellowish color. For your final one. Drop it down to about nine. Now you take the smudge. And you want to take it. Small this, drag it back so it looks like it's coming out of the barrel like that, then you just want to kind of do this, kind of make it look like a gunshot, now when we go back, Looks pretty sweet. Looks like a nice little gun flare. And if you can even do a better job, that would be even better. This isn't that good of a job. That looks pretty good there. You want to make sure you, you get some yellow throughout it. So don't just drag from the outsides. If you drag from just the outsides, make sure you drag some yellow from the center outwards and stuff. Get some spikes down there, and looks like a nice little uh, gunshot, but it's nicer to keep it smaller than that, not so long. 
Uh, this is also pretty good for like flamethrowers and things. If you want to do a nice little picture like this, you can even throw in like a black background or something. I don't know. Make it look nice. Like this. It makes it stick out a lot more. So that's my tutorial on how to make a gun flash effect in a photo. So hopefully you guys enjoyed, and I will see you in my next video.